editing Rachel here. I realized that I did not do an outro or an intro, so I'm actually going to be splitting this video into two videos. The skincare video, my top 5 or slash 10 favorite skincare products, and then my top 10 favorite makeup products. So, um, yeah, these video videos will be split into two. Hey guys, welcome to today's video. So, for today's video, instead of doing the all the entire, like, top 10 favorite skincare and makeup videos that I've been trying to do, I deleted them and I wanted to do a, like a, a better video. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you my number one favorite makeup and skincare products. I'm actually going to be doing a full look and just doing my skincare with these products. So, and I kind of wanted to try a new kind of filming style, and so far I think it's really cool. So the first things first, I want to, I'm going to be doing my kind of um, facial, um, facial skincare routine, but I'm not going to add in my steamer. I normally do steam when I do my facial routine, but I'm not going to add that in this video because you guys are, have already seen me do do my skincare routine multiple times so you don't have to like go really into detail on what I am doing. So the first product, this is my number one favorite cleanser. This is the ITK Milk to Foam Gentle Cleanser. Now I am out of this one right now. But I just wanted wanted to mention it and, and just because this is my favorite one. Favorite? I'm actually going to be using a different cleanser today. So I'm actually going to use my second favorite cleanser. This is the Jaffa Royal Royal Jelly Revitalize Gentle Cleansing Milk. I absolutely love this one too. It's amazing. I actually did forget to get my skincare brushes, so I'm, I'll be right back. Okay, now I'm going to take my cleansing brush. This is from Anissa Beauty. This is the cleansing brush. <laughs> I'm going to take that same cleanser. I'm just going to get the brush wet first. And then I'm just going to do a small amount of the brush and then just start cleansing my face. So, with this, I like to double cleanse, so I'm going to basically do this and then do it again. I, I normally start with the cleansing balm first, and then going in, into a foaming cleanser, I'm going to do a clean, just cleansing twice, and then I'm going to rinse it off. Now, after double cleansing, I want to use some sort of skincare treatment, rather if it's a kind of like an acne product or kind of like a toner. So today I'm actually going to be using number one favorite toner. This is the ITK Tri Acid Toner. This guy is my favorite. I absolutely love it. And I really like the applicator that it comes with. It has that like push downy applicator, which I think is so cool. So this is what we're going to be using today. And I'm going to take a cotton ball and just kind of do two pumps of it. Oh, that didn't really get a lot on. There we go. I'm just going to apply this all over the face. Okay, now for a face mask, I'm going to, uh, like I said, I keep, I don't keep this one in the fridge, but I keep a lot of other ones. This is another really great um, face mask, but I think it's my number two face mask because nothing can beat the uh, Lush face masks. And again, they're all, I don't know if you can see it, they're all in my, can you see it? I don't know, I hope you can't be a skincare fridge here, so I'm going to get them. I have two of the Lush face masks, and I'm feeling like I need to use this one today because I have a little bit of an acne flare-up. So this is from, obviously from Lush. This is the Cosmetic Warrior Fresh Face Mask. This is one of my favorite ones, but I switched it all to this one called Brush, Brush Strokes, and I absolutely love it. This one's for more like acne scarring, and then this one is for like, so I'm gonna use this one today. Okay, I used to use a skincare, or uh, an actual kind of liquid foundation brush to, to apply these face masks, but I switched to like a silicone applicator like this, which I absolutely love. So I am now just going to apply this all over the face. Then with this one, I noticed it's a little trickier to apply this specific face mask. Now I'm going to wait for this to dry and then we can take it off. I usually wait about five to ten minutes and then take it off. While my face mask was drying, I also applied in my hair the um, Sun In Hair Lightener. It's my favorite hair lightener. It's amazing. So yeah, now we can wash off the face mask. 
my number one favorite toner, no, serum is the ITK Brighten Brightening Vitamin C Serum. I absolutely love it. It's so nice. And I do keep this in the mini fridge as well, which is so, so great. So what I like to do is I like to take um, just a little dropper first and then just drop it on my forehead and then I take a brush. I'm going to use the Anissa Video Oliver Treatment Face Brush. These are the only skincare brushes that I've tried and they're my favorite. I don't really want to branch out and try other ones because these ones are just too good. My number one moisturizer right now is the, my number one moisturizer is the ITK Prebiotic Gel Moisturizer. I'm going to take my Anissa Beauty All Over Care Brush. I'm just going to apply some of that on the brush and then start face. Okay, next is eye cream. This is the ITK Day Plus Night Eye Cream Duo. I'm out of the day daytime one, so I've been using the nighttime one for the daytime and nighttime now, so hopefully I'm going to get a new one soon. But I'm going to use the Anissa Beauty Eye Treatment Brush to apply this. Okay, next, my top one favorite sunscreen is the ITK Serum Sunscreen. This one is my favorite. I absolutely love it. And I also love the Australian Gold one. They're really great too. This one just happens to be the best one. I'm going to try it. Okay, so I'm going to let my skin work kind of soak into my skin for a little bit, and then we are going to be doing my makeup. I hope y'all enjoyed these this two-part video on my favorite, my number one favorite skincare and makeup. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Off camera, I also applied my number one favorite lip gloss. This is the ColourPop So Glossy Lip Gloss in Spring Fever. So the last step, I'm going to 